today's Health Watch, a groundbreaking medical procedure is giving new hope to heart patients. Local 5's Connie Feldman shows us how a treatment typically used to kill cancer is now helping heal hearts. An innovative treatment is bringing renewed hope to heart patients. Doctors have performed a groundbreaking procedure using radiation therapy, typically reserved for cancer treatment, to cure a life-threatening heart condition. Shannon Brooks' heart issues began with a heart attack at age 37. A defibrillator and ablation procedure kept his heart going strong for another 18 years. But at 55 years old, Brooks went into cardiac arrest. Definitely almost lost his life a few times there with, the, with this heart. They knew that they needed to do the ablation, but they were so worried about how weak his heart was. By the time they're having this problem, refractory ventricular tachycardia, they've been through all the standard treatments and they don't have a lot of options. The only option Brooks appeared to have was a heart transplant, but Dr. Hunter had another option, a procedure so new that Brooks would only be the second patient in Utah to get it. Stereotactic radiotherapy is a standard cancer treatment, but a new option for treating his heart arrhythmia. You can do it in a non-invasive way. They just come to an outpatient facility, they sit in a chair, um, for 15 minutes, they get the therapy, they get up, they walk out. Brooks went home that same day, grateful and amazed that such a quick and painless procedure spared him from invasive surgery and the long, painful recovery that would have come with a heart transplant. What it's really done is just give me confidence to be able to be okay and know that I'm okay. Brooks said before the 15-minute procedure was even over, he was already starting to feel better. Another advantage to the stereotactic radiation procedure is that there are few, if any, short-term side effects. Because it is new, though, there is no data yet to show what will happen long-term. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Connie Fellman, Local 5 News. Thank you, Connie. Tomorrow in Health Watch, a new way to spark life into failing hearts.